Welcome to Ski Talk. I'm Steve Kopitz, the Ski EO for skis.com, and joining us is John Kirkhoff, our Nordica rep. And between us is the Transfire R3 for women. Um, I really like this boot. I think this is a great boot for that, um, that intermediate, yeah. aspiring to be stronger female skier. Yep, would you absolutely. agree with that? Um, so uh, the Transfire series is sort of the middle of the width or last of this series. Yep, one, it's one average. Two. Yep, yep, at 102. And uh, this is a three buckle boot. Tell us a th why a three buckle boot may have some advantages for women, particularly ones who have a higher instep. You know, it's a good question. Uh, the advent of three piece, three buckle boots, you know, number one is with three buckles, quick, easy uh, entry and exit from the boot, which is nice. Mm -hmm. But one of the big things by removing that four foot buckle, we get a more relaxed four foot, which we found throughout history, especially with shaped skis and wider skis and rocker skis, that the shaft of the boot is really the critical zone mm -hmm. where you need to have security. So what Nordica created was a 45 degree in step that draws you right back precisely and you you know low volume foot you can crank it down if you have a higher volume foot you can leave it more relaxed you can really fine tune the interior yeah, I know my wife always has heel slippage in her boot yeah and that's designed to help hold that heel back into the pocket yeah really defined shaft of the boot and then that plus by having three buckles instead of four you don't have that buckle that's pulling down right on that high instep so if a woman has an instep problem this could be particularly helpful for that right yeah and also that third piece that we talk about in three piece boots actually floats to rock or you know to drop to meet the shape of your foot precisely so another thing I know women like is a boot that's easy to get into yeah. there's a benefit to having a three-piece shell in that regard right? it is it's you know there's a there's a fit stirrup you just unbuckle the boot drop it on the floor grab this and step in your foot's gonna slide into this incredibly plush liner too which is nice okay uh, buckles are all micro adjustable right yep. and yep. it's got a cuff alignment for uh, yep so you can boot. align this the stance of the boot uh, tell us about the liner I, I see it's nice and soft and furry it is is I tried to actually put these in my personal boots and I just couldn't find the right size. Um, Why do the women get all the, all the good fur? You know what, I don't we should, you know, this thing's flipped for sure. We're definitely getting the short end of the stick here. Um, Nordica created something years ago called an extra warmth liner. Mm -hmm. And what we found is women's feet never get warm enough to perspire, so to speak. So we actually put a closed cell barrier in there that traps her body heat and reflects it back to the foot. So she will have a warmer, more happy ski experience skiing in these boots. That's cool. Uh, let's see, now this is a 85 flex. Yeah. So that's the softest of the yep. flexes in the series? Yep, there's a, a women's R1, R2, and this is the R3. So good all mountain performance. A gal that's adventurous, but she's probably not gonna jump off any cliffs on purpose. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, let's see, do we miss a feature or two on here? I feel like we missed something. You know, the only other thing I really like to call it in this boot is uh, the adjustment range at the top of the boot. Yeah, so women often, because they have shorter legs, yeah. their, their calves will create a, a fit problem at the top. How do you deal with that in this boot? Really three ways. One is we've scalloped the liner so it accommodates her lower leg shape. Mm -hmm. Number two, we actually give her an adjustable catch at the top of the boot that just via an Allen key in this boot, you can grow or you shrink it for one it leg shape or another. Longer, yeah. But the big one on this one is Nordica's patented technology called called adjustable cuff profile. And with that, we can actually adjust the stance and the volume in seconds with an Allen key just by going click, 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 mm -hmm. and it opens or closes to give her not just a better, more comfortable environment, but also the right stance in her boot. Mm -hmm. You know, if you have a lower leg shape, you're also totally pitched forward in the boot, absolutely brutal, drains your legs, and she's not gonna have as much fun. Yeah, I think that's really important. A lot of times uh, women are trying to crank that top buckle, not realizing that they can move the buckle over and yeah. they can open up the back to make it a much more comfortable, doesn't need to be so tight quite up there. Infinite range and adjustment on this boot. Great. So the ideal customer, once again, who? Who's All mountain skier who's adventurous. Uh, you know, she's out there for as much of the social aspects, but definitely gets the adrenaline rush from, you know, blowing but down this the But this is the strong Blue Cruiser woman. Right on the mark. Okay. Perfect. So that's the Transfire R3 from Nordica. I'm Steve. This has been Ski Talk. Thanks for joining us.